Hi everyone, and welcome back to episode 89, which I think is going to be the penultimate episode. Uh, got the bye YouTubes in there, hopefully we've got some hello YouTubes. Guys are going to be super speedy with those. Uh, okay, right. It's fine. Ghost Rider, welcome back and thank you much for your 18 month sub. Crazy. Year and a half. Hello YouTube indeed. Cool, so hopefully those ones will get going again and then... We'll all get nice and oxygenated and everyone will be happy and stops off Kating now. That would be nice. Uh, hello YouTube, indeed. Okay. Uh, right. With that that little uh, chaos aside, uh, what's going on over here? Anything, anything excited? Did we get the plastic? We didn't get the plastic, okay. Because, yeah, that plus. Did I even set the plastic up? I don't think I did in the end. I got sidetracked. Let's see, uh, I got sidetracked with blast shot. Thank you, uh, and I'm glad you get to use them. Do need to get some more emotes, so. but they are really cool. Go for a save. Okay, we did almost 1300 cycles in, I think that's where we're going to get to. That's uh, a dart subscribed as well for nine months. The, uh, the Sub hype train is going, going now. Okay. Yeah. So then this nat gas should all fall down. Do we have? Do I have a pump down here? Can we turn these pumps back on? There we go. Let's do this as well. See if we can pump out this mess. That'll also help. There we are. Back on both sides. Um, but yeah. Appreciate you guys. This. this Going back to why I made this entire run, you know, that was on the basis of uh, trying to thank my subscribers and Patreon supporters, MK Plus, um, by giving them a hotel. That was the whole point of the run. Uh, and then so many of you subscribed that you turned it into this monstrous mess. So this is all your fault, uh, especially overpowered. We can blame blame him. He uh, he decided to. Uh, Give subscribe a lot of subscriptions. Then uh, that made a whole lot of mess. And uh, yeah, then we end up here. This was only meant to be like 20... I was going to do like a 24 or maybe 48 dupe base. And then it turned into this. So uh, that's mainly thanks to him. And to all of you lovely guys as well. Right, it's getting swept. And also I assume this is on sweep only because stupid mod. Okay. Right, nice. Yeah, temps are still hot. I think I don't know what it is about this that's so bad. So I don't know why this is set to twelve because these are ten. These are ten to thirty, aren't they? This shouldn't be on twelve. This should be on seventeen at the lowest. Uh, hi, Ranio. Welcome in. Welcome in. Okay. So yeah, I mean, things are still hot. Things are very hot. Everywhere. Just light it out. Didn't crash though. We fixed all the, the crashing issues. What was the crashing issues all about? That was all my CPU, isn't it? Dodgy CPU. Um, We can, if we want to, use some nice temp shift plates to maybe take this down a bit. It might cool the tiles more directly. I don't know. I mean, this is cobalt. It will pull it out. It's done it for all the other ones. So I think it is just the cobalt they're putting in to build this stuff that's just getting very hot. And slowly, slowly we're getting there. Okay. So let's focus on these rooms, shall we? How much heat's been generated by those lights? I mean, a fair bit, but honestly, not a lot. Certainly nothing that the uh, the cooling... No, the cooling can't manage. Nice, okay. Right, oxygen is now coming in in full. Yeah, I mean, so, so ceiling lamps, they do produce a fair bit of heat. But, I mean, against my cooling loop, it's it's relatively little. Um, hmm. Why is everyone suffocating? Because they're up here. Hmm. 
Maybe we should put some oxygen diffusers in the beach. <laughs> uh, we do. Mm, a bit of a gas problem up here as well. A lot of hydrogen here too. Ideally, I think we might need to open this up and vent this out, but we can we can wait on that. Uh, make that red. Put the shower in here. Uh, lovely. We can put the bed in here as well, can't we? Because we need to take this out. Do we need this? What is this? I don't know what this is about. I'm going to tell we can put the bed in. Go out to the beach, enjoy the sun and suffocate. Yeah, exactly. It's not great up here. We've always had problems up here with oxygen. It just doesn't... There's too much of it being used below, I think. And the unfortunately, these two lines are just filling literally the bottom area. And the kitchens, right? Or kind of the kitchens. Oof, what's up with this? Are we even are we even emptying this? I don't have no idea. This is pumping so little. What is pumping? Is this more liquid? Everything's in liquid now. Okay, I see. I see the problem. Uh what we'll do is we'll Let's just break this open and get rid of the liquid. Let's try that. And then hopefully we can get rid of the suffocation beach. That would be... that'd be nice. Okay, we are getting some oxygen up here, so... That's fine, and we just need to drain this hydrogen layer. Let's focus on this for a sec, and then... We can, um... Then we'll focus on the top. Try and do one thing at a time. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure, Zarya. I'm not sure everyone does love doing that. If you guys are into some different stuff to me, but I, generally I prefer breathing, you know? Uh, yeah, I think the the liquid on here is, is too much. So, let's see if we can get rid of this. One pump should be enough. I did the maths, I think. Yeah, it's quite a lot of carbon dioxide build up. Okay, right, fill those back in please, we can let that go. And then what we'll do, we'll just do a bit of drainage. So do one up here, one up here, one up here, up here. Of course, part of the problem with this is also the lack of oxygen. Um, and also that is a tip actually for you guys. If you're earlier on, your base is a lot smaller. If you're struggling with breathability and there's a lot of carbon dioxide, it's usually that you have too much carbon dioxide and not uh, right sorry you usually have a deficit of oxygen rather than too much carbon dioxide building up um a lot of earlier bases have that problem so if you're if your base is full of carbon dioxide it's usually that you haven't got enough oxygen rather than you are making too much carbon dioxide or anything like that so okay we'll just vent this hydrogen out hopefully it'll just work its way out and we'll do eventually Hydrogen is lighter, so we'll just float along. Uh, then we'll see. We'll say the gases will be sticky. So we'll see. And it'll be very slow because it's just basically just going to delete this stuff. Yeah, surfboards are going. Hat store loves it. Okay, get rid of that hydrogen, nice. Don't want to be wasting any more oxygen. Because the thing is, even if you've got... Yeah, suffocating up here. Um, even if you've got a small bit of hydrogen here, it just blocks the, the tile. The tile can't be oxygen. That's the problem. It's very low pressure, so there's not a lot of it. But it is just blocking the tile. Come on. Right, let's get in there. That, I mean, there's absolutely no oxygen getting in here at all. Hmm. It's all being used up down here, that's the thing. Well, I'm not sure it's being used up, but it's just still not, still filling this area. So hopefully, I'm really hoping this levels itself out in the end, right. 
uh, new prints. Let's grab a new print. And into the base, uh, we have uh, Ranu. Welcome in. I know you just popped into the stream, so welcome into the base as well. If you're still here, pop you inside. There we go. Uh, and welcome to the guest schedule. You do not have to do anything. Please enjoy your stay. Okay. Right, it's giving me some confidence we'll get there. Let's see. Oof. What a mess. Uh yes, I did see your your beach head art. I mean it looks a lot neater than mine without all these silly berry tiles, so Good job on that. I I don't know if I've started a trend here, um, but uh, I've seen a few few beaches now in Oni. So there you go. I'll, uh, if I can claim any kind of trend setting, I'll, uh, I'll do that. Oh, uh, they can't get up here, can they? Let's take that out. Let's finish using the beach chairs. I think they did, Zari. I think some of them did earlier. Um, maybe not recently. Uh, okay, right. So, most of the hydrogen's gone. In fact, if that one goes, we'll be completely sorted over here. Hopefully, maybe. So, at least there is oxygen in here now and not hydrogen. So, that's a, that's a step up, you know. Uh... I just prefer that. Mm -hmm. Is it save time? It's always save time. It doesn't really matter if you've got like one one bit floating around here, but any more than that will have a problem. Our azure nymph is still growing, but we'll soon make many azure bugs to fill the base with. Oh, meteor showers are coming. Cool, that meteor blast is cutting it close. Yeah. Well, the FPS is actually quite good on single speed. That's 30 FPS here. Yeah. So now we got water up here. I don't know how that happened, but maybe it helps with the meteors on single speed. That's how, how they got through. This cuddle pip is now in space, so. You know, I, I guess that's the thing. Right. Yeah, so these rooms, they're now f out of hydrogen, so at least they are now full of oxygen. So, even if they're low pressure, they still at least have the right element in, so... Progress. That is progress. So this one is doing pretty terribly, but... It is being fed. I think it's just a time thing. This one probably took quite the worst hit. Nice. The signal speed also improves dupe think time. Um, it doesn't... Uh, I don't think it does in terms of, like, real time it takes for them to calculate. But in terms of, like, tasks per cycle, it will, because they lose less cycle time, I think. It's more efficient in that sense. But not, like, overall, not more efficient. Uh, so, uh, let's try and get this nonsense out. We will put on here... Um, Edible. Ooh, edible stew. There we go. I think that's everything in here. So if we sweep this out, then, uh, then we should be fine. We should be done with the wild planting. So there you go. It, it didn't take that long, all things considered, given how big this is. So I'd say this was a relative success. What's going on here? Oh, some some people are dying. Yeah, that that's not that's not great. Um, why? why? Uh, one, two, three. Uh, we don't have build over plants, which is very annoying. Oh, we're up here repairing stuff, huh? Do we really need to repair this? Uh,. On the low pressure area on the right, is there a gas pipe cut? I don't think so. 
Um, Zucklup, let's see. No? Uh, I mean, that one kind of doesn't... That one ends there, that one is there. The the gas pressure is, is up here, so it's just a matter of time. It's a matter of time. Okay, can we... Get these very injured guys back. Back to here. It's too hot in this area. They really want to repair this tile. There we go. Yeah, maybe don't idle here. Maybe move, you know? That would be a good idea. What? Who's died? Wolfrat? How did you die? Dead. Death. Yeah. Are we reloading? What's quicker? Let's see. 31. Right, we're going to reload again. Bear with me, YouTube. And welcome back to Moments Before Disaster. Um, I, what happened here? They This just got smashed through. Uh, can we deconstruct this? this? This is all cool enough, is it? This got injured. This got damage. I, I, mean, I think what we're going to do is just block their access to this because this area is a death trap. They are just constantly running in here and dying. So, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just block it off. Oh, good to see the old uh, Meteor Blaster doing its job perfectly there. Uh, great. And now all the power's down. All the meteors... Are d this didn't happen before, what the hell? We're just gonna have the same same thing again. Uh, what happened there? Thing is, I can't fix this without... Uh... Okay, alright, reload again. Let's go again. I, I didn't... I think we just got unlucky with the meteors. Okay, we're back in for a second time. We'll see if we can uh, hold this. So, so basically, what's happening is there's no power. Uh, I guess the meteor blaster is is powered down. I wonder if I up the power on, of priority. Does that? Mean? Yeah. So, so the meteor blaster has no power because um, where is the power being used? I don't know if it's even being used, I just don't think it's being generated. 120 watts. Spawn's not doing anything? Because the spawn has no power? I don't know. And then what happens is the... This gets damaged. Where are you going? Storing food. What are you doing? Store what food are you storing? No, just no. Don't do that. Ah, uh, the speed doesn't matter. Uh, uh, um, we already know the problem is lack of power, and then the meteor blast has no power, and then. The solar panels get broken, and they don't have Atmos suits. If we had Atmos suits, this would all be straightforward, but I just didn't put them on here because we have no reed fiber. I probably should have done a, a reed fiber farm, but let this be a lesson to everyone. Uh, Atmos suits for the win. That is that is the lesson. Um, right. Yeah, if you have Atmos suits, none of this is an issue. But when you don't, then everything breaks. All right. I don't really want to. I don't even want to send them up here to go and fix this. Although to be fair, this is kind of cold. There's a cooling loop here. Hmm. Okay. There is a cooling loop here. We could. Uh, we might get away with it. Hmm. The so ideally, what we should probably do is run this cooling loop by buy all these as well and then we'd actually have something where they might be safe enough to go up there right I've blocked this off except we've blocked this off just as uh, Kirit has decided to stand over there because you know that's that's what they do 
I want to block this off and they immediately go get themselves stuck. See if we can block this without anyone getting stuck. That'd be lovely. Um, nope. Storing food. No, you are not. They seem obsessed with storing this food. Hey, okay, thank you, Porcelet. Please get this done. There we go. Right. Now we are safe. Hmm. Question is, do we go off and try and fix this or just leave it? I'm very much on the just leave it front at this point. Uh, right. We have other things to do. We we don't need to be wasting time with this. Okay. I think this was done, right? And I lost my sweep errand. And I also lost the edible one. Oh, all those are lovely. Now all I have to do is wait. It's just waiting time. So they're growing. Bristle blossoms are growing. This has no output. Uh, great. Uh, any more? Any more not have an output? I don't think so. Uh, yeah. All looks good to me. These first ones, they'll drop by themselves. And then we just need to really cool these down. But let's say it is taking a little while, but the this is all cobalt and quite cool now. We're on 20 degrees in the pipe, so I'm sure these will come down. I know the ceiling lights are hot, but I think it's just because they're mostly made from gold amalgam, which has come from a hot place. I mean they do make heat, as we said earlier. They they definitely do make heat, but they don't make that much heat, especially compared to a water cooling loop. That will easily overpower a light by a long, a long way, so um, yeah, some of these will take a little while to, to actually get growing, but um, we'll get there. Right, and then that is the end of the wild planting saga, so thank you to everyone that uh, st stuck with me through that. I know it was a little while. Nice. We can empty that, sure. I don't know if we're even using the, the soda soda fountain. Where, where are the soda fountains? Huh? Over here. Are they even using this? I have no idea. Low priority. Yeah, fair enough. Okay. Right. Everything seems to have calmed down a little bit. Our Azure bug is old enough now and should be making some more for us. Fingers crossed. Okay. Uh, but yeah, they will do the, the sweeping as very high priority because the... Uh, the auto dispensers are on very high priority, so that's fine. And then we can reset everything to priority five, and it'll be nice and it'll be sensible, and we'll be good. Yeah, man. Always gotta just sweep up, just have a nice, nice tidy, uh, tidy farm. Can't have a mess in there. Okay. Yeah, still taking a little while to. Just work the oxygen all the way up here, but it is it is coming. I'm pretty sure it's coming. Although, okay. Uh, if we close this, that would probably help now. Rather than hinder. This is unreachable cause shenanigans. But yeah, Operation Umbrella is uh, failing. Uh, probably should use bunker tiles for this as well. Just top tip. Although. To be fair, right, so I know you should use bunker tiles. We've definitely gotten away with just using normal tiles here and piling meteors on top of it. So, uh, yes, you probably should use bunker tiles, but you can get away with normal tiles as well. So, there you go. If you've ever wondered, um, this meteor blaster is not being filled. Because of uh, weird bugs. Anyway, now it's refilled. Still weird though, the meteor, meteor blaster does not work as intended with the conveyor rails. It's not, not working. 
Okay, how are we on the extra bedrooms? I still see we don't have any plastic or cobalt over here. Also, do we have any artists over here? No, none of these are decorated, I noticed. Or some, hmm, hold on, some of these are, but some of these aren't. Um, let's see, uh, decorating. We got Sam, Skay, and Lee, or are these, no, Snow, Snow, and all this is the other one. Who's on this one? Uh, everyone seems to be banned from decorating. Did we, did we kill our artist or something? Uh, Imeric seems to have some... Imeric and World Potato, maybe? Have a quick check on the skills. I haven't touched the skills for a long time. Uh, let's see... Imeric... Okay. Has... has oh, hasn't quite got there. Uh, what was the other one? World Potato only has one. Damn it. Um... Because most of these dupes don't really have any skills at all. Uh, right, but, but let's just give them... Because they were new dupes and they just weren't really doing anything, so... Uh, they never really got any skills. Uh, who did I just give? Nancy... Nancy Botwin, there you go. Not really meant to be an artist, but gave you the skills, so... We can do it. See if my mouse wheel works. Go up. Nancy, where are you? That's the one. Okay. Yeah, we must have had an artist over here and then they moved them back or they died or something silly. Uh, what is going on here? Hmm. Guess we're going to have to bridge this one. Didn't quite finish that. Get rid of those. Okay. Uh, there's some doors missing over here. Okay, these doors are just randomly open, but there you go. We'll live with it. Wait, I have no proper carbon dioxide uh, solution down here either, which kind of sucks. Other than just one pump that, that runs most of the time anyway. Okay, and... So, we just need to send some bits through and get that finished off. Nice. Yeah, I think there is enough oxygen in here for them to not suffocate. Maybe. We are up to 1100 over here, so... Some oxygen's coming up here. Still relatively few, but... It's coming, it's coming. Okay. It looks like... The millwood and bristle blossoms are done. I don't see any more sweeping actions in here. So... We will uh, take this door out, swap it with some insulation, and we will reprioritize the whole thing to five. There we go. Lovely. That was a that was a project project and a half, wasn't it? So I finally got through that, despite my poor RSI. <laughs> and we're still waiting for some of these to cool down, but they'll cool down. Give it a while. And the uh, the pips, I think, will turn into meat, so... Because I'll put a load of domestic ones in here, so they will starve. Although there may be a couple of wild ones as well. What's this guy? Tame. He's wild. I'm tame. So the tame ones will die, turn into meat. Uh, the wild one will keep laying eggs in here, so... I'll be fine in that. We don't need to do any more wild planting, so I think we're okay on that front. Well, I'll say that. We do have a bit more wild planting over here to do, but I'm kind of going low priority on this. We do have the, we have used the espresso machine. I've seen them using the espresso machine, so I'm counting that as a win. Um, quickly double check up on the water, since we were having water issues earlier. I say, yeah, with the, with those geysers coming online, we're now gaining water quite rapidly, so that's fine. We are all good. And the oxygen is, uh, is all fine as well. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Look, there we go. So the the sunroom is now being reoxygenated. So it's now usable without suffocating. See, sorry, we said we we get there. Then this one is just coming up. So give that give that a minute. We'll get there. Right. What's going on? This. 
I think I think the answer might be we need two meteor blasters everywhere. I think having one is actually not reliable enough. Maybe that's that's a lesson here. Um Okay. Elderly fool, nice, right? Oh Gassy moves are all happy. Oh we have an illumination problem here as well. Oh nice. Hikers did two of those in one go. That was quick. Almost like not thinking about it. for ages. Yeah, I th I think you do. I think I've had two before and it's been fine, but uh yeah, didn't plan for that, so I suppose we could just stick a second one on, on. I don't know if it fits. Uh, but that's that's top tip anyway, guys. Make sure you have two. Uh, okay, good. The gas grass is growing. The gassy moves are happy. Uh, at least they are. There's the accumulation. In comes another one. Uh, and hopefully we'll grab it. We should have six in here. Six is the stable limit. So unless you put in one of those new. What even is it? I don't. I don't use these uh, uh, criticondo things. Airborne criticondo. I do. I suppose you can get one extra one in there. They're kind of. Yeah, they're not. I mean, they're not terrible. Not terrible. Just. Uh, I suppose you then have to. I need more plants, so it can't be pointless. Yeah, look at that. They're all on the beach. Although when there's so many of them, then they do use up all the oxygen. So. But look, there you are. Look. Flea is finishing their beach chair use. Uh, IOPS4 killjoy. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, I, I'm very happy with it. So, um, appreciate the uh, the compliment. Yeah, I think it's good in the end. It's good in the end. It took us quite a while to get there. How are we on plastic? Got loads of plastic. And cobalt. Actually, we're running out of cobalt. Um, my mouse wheel is all over the place. I keep trying to blow into it as if there's like dust in there that's gonna help. Uh, right, let's grab another dupe. You come seeking advice. Well, you've come to the right place because I'm sure I will be able to help, or uh, anyone else in the chat will help as well. Uh, Ruby or Oxalica, welcome in. Do the normal stuff. Yes, please feel free to ask questions, guys. I mean, I'm always open to that. To say, in uh, edu, what do you call it? Edutainment. What we do, so I like answering questions, and Twitch chat is almost always very helpful for Oni. So there we go. Right, that's uh, that's it. So I think we now have. I think there's one more to come into um into this base, if I remember correctly, to this one. Where have we got? I think this uh this bed and this bed should be the last two. Let's double check. Miscellaneous. Okay, so another bed. Are these rooms good? Luxury barracks, that's good. There's no bed in there. Washroom, that's great. Okay. Need to get this bed in here, that there, please. Uh, sorry, I can't see chat for a sec as well, so if you are asking a question, I can't see it right now, but we'll have a look very shortly. Let's get those sorted. Okay, we have to bump priority on everything or nothing gets done. This is a private bedroom. That's lovely. We'll put that, that. Oh, not that. Do that. Shower. Toilet. Bump do that. Oh, there you go. Right. Right, back to which chat. The volcano tamer, you come from beer tier and the mini size mate. Made of steel are overheating. Copper volcano. Yeah, that that that's a good question, Drunk Monkey. How if you don't have enough steam in there? Because if you think about it, so the the volcano puts out a certain amount of heat energy. Um, the temperature then raises depending on how much uh, thermal mass there is in there. So thermal mass, in this sense, being literal mass, how much stuff, um, and also how much specific heat capacity it has. Um, if yeah, eleven kilos per tile is too low. I would suggest. I would suggest well, exactly what Drunk Monkey is saying, and if you put more water in, I mean, not even a lot. Like if you bottle emptied uh, one or two goes in there, I think you'd get the the right amount you're looking for. But that's probably the issue. Yep. Uh, okay. Private bedroom, washroom, 
that's a private bedroom that will become a washroom so that's fine um we must make sure we have a mushroom picture so close the mushroom redecorate please if you've only got one it has to be a mushroom uh so that's those two bedrooms sorted then over here we have oh no shower in that sink in that And did I? I can't remember if we said we had one more in here or if that was it. Also, I guess I've left all these sinks on both ways, haven't I? I haven't done the arrows. Or have I? No, I have done the arrows on this one. Not sure I can be bothered to do that. Uh, let's see. Uh, luxury barracks, washroom, private. Oh, private bedroom is not luxury barracks, is it? Private bedroom. Come here, bed, cot. Decor item two. Okay, so this counts. This counts, right? So if I had sorry luxury barracks over here, that's private bedroom. Okay, right, they're all private bedrooms. Awesome. Why is this a luxury barrack? Huh? Why is this a luxury barracks and this is a private bedroom? Twenty-four. I'm a bit confused. Uh, we can put steam. Yeah, water steam is one one to one. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's slightly less with polluted water and salt water because a small amount turns into the soils, but it's it's a very small amount. You definitely get most of the water. Why is this a luxury barracks and not a private bedroom? Single bed. Can't. Echo item two it has back wall tiles. Am I missing back wall tiles somewhere? Let's have a look. I'm missing one back wall tile. Great. No, I don't want oxygen. I want the tile, please. There we are. I'm missing one tile. Right, let's do a quick mineral check on here then, shall we? Uh, are we missing any tiles? I mean, we would be leaking to space, I think, if we are, so... Better not be. Right, I think we got away with that. All right. Let's take control. Still suffocating down here. We are... Having problems down here. Uh, I have blood, blood light. This pump, okay, this pump is going. Uh, empty that. Uh, hmm. Okay, I, we, we also got to sort the clothes out as well, but we do that right at the end because that's kind of the last thing to do. All right. Uh, I think, yeah, close these up. Close that up. These are all done. So many, so many uh, mealwood now. There you go. Look at that. That really took a while, didn't it? We got there in the end. Let's grab a quick picture of that. May use that as a thumbnail. Who knows? There you go. Screenshot so slow. So slow. And the bristle blossoms are somewhat far behind, but they are coming. Uh, these also take a bit longer to grow. 24. Right, so we got our first ones in, what, 15 cycles plus four. Oof. Uh, these are just about going to squeak in time, I think, for the end of the next episode. So, let's see. We, I, I kind of have that as a requirement. I'd really like to see them actually get the juicer going. That would be nice. And um, we can't end this run without seeing the juicer. That would not be, that would not be okay. Uh, okay, we got Azure Nymph. Egg, Azunu. Can't see any Azunims there. Right. Go for a save. So many wild plants. I know, I know. It took us ages. It took us ages, but we got there in the end. Disabled uh. mm -hmm. bow. Why do we have coral nymph in here? Ooh, did I forget? I forgot to change this over to Azunim. Right. My bad. I hope we haven't lost any. I don't think we have. Nice. Okay, okay. It's looking sweet. I think we're getting there. Uh. Yeah, nice. Okay, so these are all good. So bedrooms over here. Uh, we don't have any... Oh, oh yeah, I say that for any. We have some plastic and cobalt. Uh, private bedrooms, lovely. 
This is still a barracks. Oh, are these not big enough? Sorry, these are going to be a luxury barracks because they're, they're actually not big enough. So we're going to have to slum it. Whoever's in here is going to be slumming it, I'm afraid. That's a... Uh, you, you, we're minus one morale on those, but... Oh well. Sorry guys, I'm going to lump it. Uh, I guess we can... I'm missing some... What are crown moulding bits? Well, they renamed them, didn't they? They're not crown mouldings anymore. Fauna trim, of course. Uh, why are all of these missing? Because we're all missing them. Damn it. I really don't want to decorate this whole flipping thing. And take ages. Uh, well, I say ages. There's, this is the smaller plant toy, so. Oh, great. They're all missing. They're all missing. How did this happen? Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you, lads. Yes. I mean, I, I believe I have all those things. A lot of patience, yes. Um, I just hope it's entertaining for you guys, you know, because I I try and keep this fresh and moving and I do appreciate when we do super big um, super big things. It takes a while, it takes a lot of patience and I just hope it's entertaining enough as we go along, you know, because um, there's a bit of waiting around. Well, thank you. And uh, yeah, I, I, I will do a, I'll do a proper summary of this as a YouTube video. But I will also before we end the run in the next episode on YouTube, um, I'll do a do a summary for you guys too. Video on setting up that farm. Um, uh, I have a tutorial bike for it, blah blah. Yes, so not that one specifically, but if you want to learn about um, wild planting and uh, sorry, whip hip planting and wild farming, I can I can link you the video on that. Give me a sec. Uh, let me get a link for this. Come on. There we go. Pop it in the chat. Um, yeah, I mean, otherwise, if you actually want to watch me, it's all on the, the VODs are all on YouTube, so you can watch all the VODs, but doing that farm took probably about nine, ten hours, so it's quite a while. You know, you might not want to watch all of that. If you want the short version of how to do it, uh, that is the video for you. Yeah, nice. Right. We are getting oxygen back into the top of this, this tower this area so oxygen's been restored we just have a bit of a problem down here really um but we're okay we're doing all right we're doing all right uh okay so i think these bedrooms are sorted um i guess how much cobalt we still have cobalt this isn't sweep only is it is this just are they just moaning about low priority manual use Oh, did I just not put this on again? I keep going to put this on and I never put this on. Uh, right, that'll be the, the issue. Let's put the cobalt and the plastic through here. Sorry, not glass, plastic. Cool. Uh, yeah, it's downtime now. Let's ping those through. Um, to the other planetoid. What else do we need to do on here? That That is the question. That is the question. Uh, we still technically have these pinches that are not planted. Um, let me see, we've got three more seeds. We are, unfortunately, we're not going to get this pinch of pepper plant farm done. Because uh, I don't want to wait for it. It's, it's going to take many more hours to get this done. Because we're relying on the seeds that it's already making itself to plant the rest. So... If I had all these seeds, planting this would probably take maybe an hour. Um, waiting for the seeds to generate is going to take many hours, and we do not have many hours. So, unfortunately, that's not going to happen. But uh, the main thing I want to see is getting the juicer done. Uh, so, so here's the to-do list, guys. This is the kind of where we when we can end the run. Uh, one is getting the juicer running. That is a requirement. Two is getting all the dupes in, getting all my lovely subscribers where I, at least before I got the cutoff, I know there's so many of you that subscribed after that point and this run went so long. Uh, so appreciate all of you, but unfortunately you can't make it in. But we still need to get everyone that I promised I would get in, in. So that is the other thing. Uh, let me have a quick check. What else do we need to do? Um, 
So that was done. So Spork is done. Cuddle Clip was done. The other plant play was done. We got Brackeen. Um, the espresso machine was done. The pinch of pepper. Uh, we we have we've used it. We've used the pin the espresso machine. So in fact, like they can they can still service it now. So that is working. The soda machines. I guess we should also bump these. I want to see those working. We uh, we've pretty sure we've seen them working as well. That's fine. So we just need that. Uh, the juicer. Yeah. Uh, soda fountain the monument is done uh the clothing the clothing is the last thing we're going to need to do because we can't, can't do that let's grab the last blue blueprint quickly what have we got let's see if it doesn't skip on some roll five there we are classic dice nice uh is that the, that's the new wallpaper isn't it the new uh new one they added uh yeah so clothing is something we need to sort out at the end the surfboards are in surfboards are at the top course there uh, shine bug room that is done we now have zero bugs as well nature reserve was done and the, the other thing i've got is carpet tiles but unfortunately we don't have we just don't have enough uh, reed fiber to certainly not to carpet the entire base that's not going to happen um i may well why don't we um i will replace this area with uh in the nature reserves not the not those with some carpet so i think I don't know if that's enough to give them the tickle tootsies, but hopefully that does something. Uh, hold on, what do you... Sadat saying bye YouTube. It's alright. It's alright Sadat, we, we're a bit, uh, we're offset because the, uh, um, yeah, because of the internet outage. So, you jumped the gun a bit, probably quite a bit. Let's replace those with carpet tiles. I do actually need to work out when the end of the episode is because uh, I did lose track a bit with all those reloads. Well, we had too many deaths and uh, tried to reload people. Let's see. Uh, let me do a quick bit of mental maths. Uh, into, into, into. Uh, okay. I think we've got another 10 to 15 minutes left on this episode. <laughs> Don't worry. Who's... what? Oh. Great. <sighs> okay. Well, I guess we're just going to... Um... Didn't realise I got stuck. This, this is the problem with so many fake suffocation warnings, is that when there's a real one, you can't find it. Okay, well, so what I'm going to do, because I'm not going to roll back, because it's saving every two every two cycles, so I'm not going to roll back to 12.35. It's too much. It's too much. We're going to get Alarat out. We will reincarnate Alarat. Uh, and then, yeah, if we, if we wind up short on dupes, basically, I think what I'm leaning towards is uh, Alarat, come back in, please. You just passed, and now you are back. Um... What I'm leaning towards now is when we get to like the end of the th this the normal length on Twitch, I think anyone that's not in that's still on list, I'm afraid, will not make it in. So we will we may have to just cut cut the list a little bit short by one or two people. And people dupes dying like that is going to make it worse. Uh, no, 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 I wasn't wrapping up. Uh, 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 we have a little bit to go. Uh, I will I will declare my mini wrap up. It's fine. Uh, yes, so we'll, we'll get, yeah, we've got Alarat back in, so that's fine. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll just, I think we'll just limit the dupes to, uh, to the number, to the number there. So we'll see where we get to. Okay, why is this, are these on sweep only? Because of the stupid mod again. Great, thank you. Default setting mod, really being annoying. At least we noticed. Get that meal wood into the uh, main area, into the storage. Uh, yeah. So yeah, it's clothes last. It's the espresso. Um, not espresso. It's the juicer, and it's getting the dupes in. So, I think that's kind of those are those are the things we need to do before before we wrap this one up. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, here we do. 
is hiya flinwinch this is the fungus indeed i am the fungus i am among you so welcome in a lot of people come across from youtube tonight so uh i'm glad you guys came across but this is this is the final stream for this run and then there will be uh there'll be some downtime uh, yeah i know i really should have gone back in there drunk monkey I, I did do that once and then it reset i think on some update and I haven't gone back in since, but I complain about it every time. <laughs> every time. And then uh, forget. Uh, why is this getting so cold? Oh. Whoops, I think I've gone a bit too cold there, actually. This is going to start getting uh, getting too cold. Whoops. I forgot about the uh, plus minus seven thing. Well, I, I knew it was seven. I went to the minimum. Uh, yeah, I should have gone. Now I've gone to the maximum. All right, we'll, we'll back this cooling loop off a bit because it's uh, it's over chilling the uh, the plants. Great. Now they're not growing right, too cold. <laughs> oh dear, this is a litany of errors. Someone grab um, Alarat. I assume we have some. We still have uh, some memorials available. Let's fill it up. And uh, we can close this up. Um, ooh, uh, 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 this isn't still making pickled meal, is it? It is still making pickled meal, okay. I'll turn that off. Don't want pickled meal, we've got to use all of this just for uh, uh, random juicer nonsense. Yeah, we don't we don't want the frozen. Well, there's we can we can freeze the meal lice. We just don't want to freeze the meal uh, meal wood. Uh, let's see if we can grab that soup back as well. Uh, maybe maybe where was Alarat over here? Anything else? Anything else? Sweep this stuff up. Okay, redo the prior to this plant. And close this back in. Trying to make it more like a rhyme map. Exactly. We get some blue back on, on this very orange map at this point. Um, yeah, I think you could tell it's a rhyme map, but it's looking less and less like it. Okay. Let's get this polluted water out. Would be nice. Nice and uh, neat, neat and tidy. Then we can uh, close this back up. I can't believe we trapped Alarat in here. I mean, there was absolutely no reason for him to be inside. Still got trapped. I didn't. I didn't see uh, unreachable food or anything. Maybe because they were inside with the meal light. Yeah, I mean, I think organized mess is is fair. It's fair. <laughs> I I can't really. I mean, to be fair, it was a mess as we got there. Um, you know, the getting there was a messy bit. I think, I think now everything's looking relatively tidy, right? I mean, uh, someone just took his place inside the farm. Oh, thank you. Thank you for, uh, doing it, for letting me know. Yeah. What is it with these dupes and just, I don't know. All right. I tell you what, I'm just going to leave this open because apparently it seems impossible to shut this without dupes committing suicide. So... Let's just leave it open and then, yeah, sure. There you go. I mean, it's already open at the top, so does it really matter? Probably not. Okay, right, this meal was just unfrozen, so... We're okay. Everything's good. Oh, yeah, thank you, Block Shadow. Yeah, well, I'm just going to leave it open, so we can't do this. So, cause I think every dupe we kill now is another dupe that's not going to make it in. Or another subscriber that's not coming in, so... Uh, let's see. Uh, I have... Hmm. Do I have any beds free, or is it, is this it? Why do I have 99? I feel like I should have an even number. Is there a free bed here? Was, was Alarat's old bed free? This one? This one? This one's unassigned. Uh, that's true, I could do. It's fine, I'll just leave it open. I mean, it's not going to make any odds. The Corley loop will get it. Um, 
Yeah, so I think there's one free bed here, and I think this is a hundred. Let's see. I did count this last time. One, two, three, five, seven, sixteen, twenty. There's twenty in there. Uh, It's 50 up to there, and then I, it's symmetrical, right? So it should be 50 and 50. I think that's 100. So it means we can take one more on here, and then every other dupe has got to go over here. Fortunately, I think the plastic has come through. We have a lot of plastic. So let's take that off here. Uh, and then is there any more cobalt to come through? Yeah. Nice. Again, th this is really hot over here. Um... The uh, yeah, this this cooling system just not effective. I mean, it's cold, but the oxygen comes in cold and then just does very little. I mean, it's, it's so slow, so slow. I would really recommend using an actual liquid cooling loop inside the base rather than just cooling the oxygen, um, unless you have a couple of hundred cycles plus to to be able to wait to cool it down. So. I mean, it has kind of worked over here. I mean, this is now 20 degrees, so, you know, this is kind of working. It's kind of working. Uh, right. Nice. We have an azure, some azure nymphs. We're getting there. We're getting there. Anyone on this carpet? I don't know what they're doing if they're not doing this carpet. Like, what, what jobs are they? How is this number 28? Rock crusher, dirt, repair, mop, harvest... Oh, there's, there's a lot of stuff on this list. There's a lot of stuff. Everything's, everything's priority five. Doesn't know what to do. Okay. Yeah, we leave this on harvest. Just to offset the fact that we don't have enough of them. And also try and get more seeds. We'll, we'll get as many seeds as we can, but we won't get this finished, finished. Uh, annoyingly. But I mean, we've done, we've certainly done more than half. So, yeah, maybe we've got half of an espresso machine working. Okay, this is looking better. And there's only a few red ones now. Which is illumination. These, these ones are body temperature, but these ones are illumination, so somehow... See, there you go. This is the advantage of leaving it open. You can go in and fix it. I, uh... Yeah, so we can get those for illumination, and these ones, uh, for some reason, are still holding out as a little bit warm. But everything else... Everything else is looking nice and toasty, so that's, that's perfect. Cool. Alright, I think we're good. Um, yes. Things looking good. We just have we just have to grab in the last handful of dupes. There's a lot of pips in here. Oh my god. Is this door open? We should let this door open actually. That's what we should do. Then just let all the pips out. Why not? Just let them roam. Uh we put open on this one as well. We'll just let them in. We'll let, let the pips wander wherever they want. That's that's the plan. There you go. They can wander now all up and down the hallway. Can't get out of there. That's fine. Right. When we open this, we should have a mass pip exodus, I think. Let's see. If anyone actually does it. I mean, priority five. Priority five is not going to cut it, I don't think. Although, eh. It's somewhat higher than priority list. Come on. Release the cuddle pips, and then everyone can get cuddles. Actually, this is this is a lot of pips. Um, they do only cuddle, I think, twice per, um, twice per go. Yeah, I I, I already have. I think the thumbnail for this one we're going to use as the mealwood probably. Um, so, and then the last the last episode has got to be the entire base. I'm going to try and get a good, good thumbnail for that. You release the cuddle pips, so everyone can have a big cuddle. <laughs> there's so many of them. There's, only, there's six of them actually generating the eggs, and so many spares. Good. Hopefully everyone will get cuddled. Here comes the carpet, which is great. Everyone will get tickled tootsies. 
I don't know what the morale's like. The morale must be 64. Hmm. We never. We, we're not even close. 75. Okay. Some of them are close to the hundred. Um. But yeah. Nice. Why don't we um? We do, we just open the. If we open the, the doors to the kitchen, uh, the the eating areas as well. Then the pips can go in there. But the pips could just go everywhere. We'll leave, we've got to keep them closed in here and the hospital, for example. We can go in here. We could go in here. We don't want to keep them out of, out of that room. Uh, yeah. We'll just open these up. I mean, why not? The beach. The pips on the beach. <laughs> That's us. There's a weird only, only spin-off. Right. But I think I have reached the end of this episode so I'm, i might be a little bit wonky on the timings because of those those couple of reloads i didn't write down exactly where i should have stopped so i'm a little bit over i suspect but anyway close enough um as we go for a save as well oh as we go for a crash uh right so we just cut back in quickly just so i can uh, wrap up the episode so the, the save just crashed it for some reason but um yeah, I'll, I'll quickly leave it here and jump to the next episode, the final episode. So I look forward to seeing you in the last final episode. Other than that, thank you very much for watching the series. I'll see you next time.